happy, but the Ghana forces have also issued a statement about this particular incident uh, that led to the some military personnel, three of them, sustaining gunshot wounds and lifted to Accra for medical treatment. They've been given some details about it, but what we do know as well is that the police have confirmed that some two persons have died or were killed yesterday as a result of uh, that exchange of gunfire. Ghana Armed Forces personnel have conducted a series of search operations in Bokwenet and Varans in a bid to fish out armed assailants following the renewed clashes and sporadic shootings over the past days. This led to the exchange of fire between personnel of the 11 mechanized battalion and some armed assailants. In the process, one assailant died and five persons, including three soldiers, were injured. Ten suspects were arrested and handed over to the Boko District Police for further investigations. According to the statement, in the early hours of Wednesday, 16 March 2022, troops deployed at Sabongari had gunshots emanating from an uncompleted building. They proceeded to the location and in a bid to cordon off the area. While they attempted to do that, armed assailants fired at the troops, resulting in injuries to the three soldiers. An exchange of fire therefore inevitably ensued between the troops and the assailants. Subsequent to this, the personnel of the 11 mechanized battalion with the support of the police stepped up with their cordon and search operations at uh, Buabula and Pusiga to fish out the suspect who had shot at the three soldiers. The statement further explains the conditions of arrest and tracing of the assailants as well as their military. The statement signed by Captain Michael Adulabi of the Public Affairs emphasizes that although the situation has been brought under control, the troops remain on high alert to deal with any situation that may arise. Again, on claims that personnel from the Ghana Armed Forces are on rampage killing people and animals, Cap says that they are false and diversionary and must be ignored. Still on the conflict.